we are going to make spectacular snowflakes. And here's a sample of one of our templates. And the directions are at the top. So when you get one of these and you cut around the square, be sure to keep the directions to help you. I have one that's already cut out. I kept my directions. And I wanted to show you how this is going to work. Once you've gotten a little experience, um, I find with some of the templates, it's very easy to take a blank piece of paper and make your own. And snowflakes are lots of fun to hang and decorate in all different places, in your classroom, in the hall, at home. So our directions, I've numbered them as we go, cut out the square, then we fold it diagonally in half. And then we fold it once more to get a smaller triangle. And notice how I'm folding in a way that I'm still able to see all those lines on the one side. Then it says fold the left section towards the back. So let's take a look at that. So I've I've made my smaller triangle. We're going to consider this our front, okay? And whether you're holding it this way or this way, it doesn't matter. But the section to the left gets folded towards the back. So I'm going to flip it over and use the lines to help me. And you can see I took that left side and made it so it folds back. And then we do the same with the right, which is easier because the left is there to help us with our fold. Now, keeping these directions to help you fold blank pieces of paper is very helpful. Before you start cutting, turn your snowflake so that you have the horizontal line and the paper. Um, on this one, we can see the print is the front, but if you're folding a blank one, it'll, you'll look for that horizontal line. You're going to cut along the horizontal line. And then you're ready to cut out all of the gray. When I'm all done cutting, I have this alarmingly tiny piece of paper, which might make me think I made a mistake. But we shouldn't assume. Let's open it up and see what we have. Aha, uh -huh, voila. So a few thing, a few takeaways from this. Number one, folding, there's lots of different ways we can fold. Folding in the way this template describes is going to allow you to create the same type of experience. Also, we cut away a lot of paper and we still have a spectacular snowflake. Another fun thing to try is to make your own designs. There are all different ways you can come up with different designs to create your own template. So you get a blank piece of paper and you fold it and then you draw your own lines and see what you come up with. Have fun creating your own winter wonderland with some creative snowflakes.